Here I am in Launceston, the second largest city in Tasmania, after Hobart, which is better. <laughs> Launceston is just like Hobart, but without the harbour, the restaurant scene, the beautiful historic architecture and Mona. It's a quaint little town, and by quaint, I mean shithouse. Make no mistake, this place is a shithole. Tonight on Go Away, I'll show you why. Dirty bastards. <laughs> Let's start by meeting the Mayor of Launceston, right at the heart of this disappointing town. First of all, Albert, I need to ask you, how do you respond to allegations that Launceston is a shithole? Oh, it's rubbish. It's absolutely rubbish. It's a fantastic place to live. We've got so much going for it. We've got some great assets to go and see and visit, so a fantastic place to live. Wouldn't you prefer to be the Mayor of Hobart? Oh, definitely not. I mean, great to be up here. I mean, we are the third oldest city, but we are the best city in Tasmania and Australia. How far is the mainland from here? Oh, it depends how you want could to go. Could I swim it? No. Well, well I, I might need to get out quick. I don't think you could swim it, but I think you'd have to be a very good swimmer to swim it, but it's an hour flight. Do you know any mainland jokes? Mainland jokes? <laughs> no? Oh, no, I have nothing that comes to mind at the moment, no. It's almost as if it's better. It's not better, no, it's not better. It's all... Uh, it's not bad. <laughs> All right. To prove his point, the mayor shows me one of Launceston's main tourist attractions. The old umbrella shop. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. So why is it called the old umbrella shop? Is it because the umbrellas are old or because you're old? <laughs> you can I guess, if you look at us. Yeah. I saw your gollywogs in the front window. Yes. It's like they're at the front going, if you're politically correct, do not come in. <laughs> If those racist dolls didn't scare you enough, there's also the Launceston City Ghost Tour. If you don't believe in ghosts because you're an adult, a ghost tour is just a really long, boring walk through a city at night time. Now, has anyone got any questions for me at all? Oh, yeah, I've got a question. OK, yes. When is this going to get scary? <laughs> Lights depart regularly from the mainland. Or, if you're an idiot, you can jump on the spirit of Tasmania and spend eight hours on one of the worst stretches of water in the world. And even then, that's only to Devonport. It's up to you to get to Launceston. What I'm saying is, don't get on the boat. <laughs> if you absolutely have to go to Launceston, you should visit the monkeys in City Park, despite them all having herpes, a fact they seem to be quite proud of. At least I'll be safe behind this herpes protective barrier. <laughs> I'm here to meet Dale Pope, who spends far too much time with these creatures. Are the monkeys a bit like the locals, just unemployed, sitting around all day doing f all? Uh, they got a big job, these fellas. They're going to please the uh, visitors that come into the park. They all have a bit of a chew on each other's asses too, I've noticed. <laughs> now, how many of them have herpes? Not many. How did they get it? Like, who gave it to who? But which one's the mad rooter? Oh, uh, well, you, you see the big fella who's out there. They do have herpes, though. Yeah. And we have to keep them calm so they don't shed the virus. Where would they shed it? Through their fluids, blood, oh. saliva, oh. semen, oh. whatever you like. Whatever I'd like, I'd, I'd prefer <laughs> none of it. Not enjoying this town is thirsty work. This is Bogue's Brewery, where they make the second best beer in Tasmania after Hobart's Cascade. <laughs> this beer's better! <laughs> so there you have it. If you're going to come to Tasmania, go to Hobart. If someone recommends coming to Launceston, tell them to go away! <laughs> Can I get off now? <laughs> Don't want to be stuck on this shit for an hour.